At their final school board meeting of the school year, Canfield Local Schools voted to take the bond issue that failed on May 3rd off the ballot in August, leaving funding for some facility repairs up in the air. First News reporter Desiree Gosselin was at the meeting for that vote and shares what the board plans to do next. To remove the question of the issuance of bonds from the August 2nd. That vote passed unanimously. Yes, Scrooge. Yes, Mr. Evans. After the bond issue failed during the primary vote by close to a three to one margin. The plan that we had in place isn't the one that we could do moving forward. That failed seven mil bond issue would have raised nearly $108 million for repairs. So, the, the options are repair, renovate, or build new. 85 million of that was earmarked for building a new school, which would combine two elementary schools and one middle school with a bus garage. Going to be suitable for all of the Canfield Superintendent Joe Knoll says it's basically back to square one. The conversation that the board's going to have moving forward. Right now, the board does not have a plan on which way to move forward. Reporting in Canfield, Desiree Goslin, WKBN 27 First News.